Give me five forty fives. The Vinyl Minimalist is holding a contest and I am joining it. You're going to hear my dog chewing his food. That's just the perils of making videos. So the purpose of this video is to show five linked 45s and he gives so many different ways that you can do this. So I really, really, really wanted to show five Phil Collins 45s that were just his portraits. And I was so close. I have four. So I was sad about that. But maybe, does this count? We get the back of his head on one. So we've got Phil's face there. We've got the blue side angle. we got the red side angle. And we have to hold these up together. Look at this. So cool. Wait, can you see it in the screen together? Oh, like that. Like that. That's gorgeous. And then the the last one you get is his face right in the middle. So I want, let's see if I can hold them all up together. Like, oh wait, this one goes in the middle like this. Or you could do it like this where he's staring at himself. If I drop one of these, I'm gonna be mad because I really like these. Okay, so something like this. Now. I have four, so let's just pretend I have five with his hair. But, so I have another Phil Collins. Come on, that is a bad cover compared to these. And this one is Why Can't It Wait Till Morning. It's just, you know, I mean, it's a wild night in a hotel, I guess. Something like that. All right, so those were my 545s. But I'm going to continue in a portrait mode okay so i'm gonna show across the screen five funko pops from iron maiden which i have shown before and i'm gonna show five comics that have portraits on the cover there you go there's swamp thing he's looking kind of mad in this one he's growing all kinds of weird tentacles here's the joker this might be frank quietly yes it is there's an fq i really like this guy's artwork now this is not my favorite piece by him but his artwork is certainly always very interesting okay so there's a joker here's a side profile of hawk man so kind of like oops <laughs> kind of like phil <laughs> this one is a villain and i don't remember who that is so sorry but it's a pretty cool cover if i could get rid of that glare there we go. And the last one is by, I think the artist's name is Frank Cho. And that's Harley Quinn. So there you go. Five portraits. But I'm not done. I'm going to show five book covers with, with portraits on them. And most of them are Russian. Okay, so here we go. Here is uh, a Dostoevsky cover, Notes from the Underground. There's a bunch of, like, mad Russians on these. Here's another... Dostoevsky, I mean, look at these people in the background. But there you go. That one is Notes from the Underground. <laughs> oh my goodness. It's the same book. I think there are uh, tra two different translators. I just realized that. Two different translators. Next, we have our third Russian. And that's Yevgeny Yevtushenko, a poet and short story writer. Right? That's not quite a portrait, but sorry. Uh, going along with Phil Collins' back, back of his head, there we got um, Arthur Miller's The Crucible. There you go. Beautiful, beautiful art. And finally, let's just throw in this Quentin Crisp, The Naked Civil Servant. Look at that. Awesome portrait and awesome color. So there you have it. Vinyl, vinyl minimalist. Uh, we also have to throw in a hashtag and we were supposed to say something if we couldn't find the 45s. Something about the vinyl minimalist sucks. I'm not sure exactly what, he like had this script that we were supposed to write and we're supposed to say the vinyl minimalist sucks and his record collection sucks and um his video suck i think that's what we were supposed to say 
So there's my contest entry from Garage Geek, who doesn't suck. Garage Geek rules. Everybody out there, thank you for the support.